Hi friends, welcome to my channel. In this video, I am going to install any custom ROM using the ADP side load. So friends, right now some of the users are facing the same issue that they cannot able to see the internal storage when their mobile phone is connected to the system. So in this in in this method, so we can able to flash any custom ROM using the ADB side load using the command prompt so you just need to do one thing so as you can see here so I have just installed the TWRP recovery here you just need to install the TWRP recovery and now you just need to do one thing just click on advanced and click on this ADB side load so once you click on this ADB side load and just here you can see the starting ADB side load feature is enabled and now in this system you just need to do one thing you just need to enter adb side load yeah you just need to enter adb side load space adb space side load space and you just need to go to the rom file where you exactly downloaded the roms so in my case i have just downloaded it here so once after doing that you just need to first drag the rom file here and you just need to paste it here okay so i, ha I haven't done it correctly so just drag this and paste it here so once after that just click on enter okay and as you can see it will start running here so the patching system image unconditionally so it is now just started and you can also see the percentage here in the on the system the system that it is at two percentage so no need to worry about that you just need to wait for some time and once it got flashed so we just need to flash the firmware using the same method so I'm not pausing the video friends because it might be difficult if I pause the video so I'll just uh, play the video continuously so you can just skip it So friends right now it is at 28 percentage so it will just take some time so i think it will just uh, load up to around 47 or 48 so that's it so as you can see it will be habituated for you if you are flashing the room like this using the adp side load so please be patient friends do not uh, uh, try to skip because there might be some issues so just try to wait for some time and see the entire process so that it would be very helpful for you So in this video, I'm I'm just uh, flashing the Pixel Experience Plus ROM in Realme X7 Max. 
so yeah so this is the first stroke for us so i'm just flashing that rom in order to show you how to flash any custom rom using the adp side load okay so right now it is at the 40 percentage so i think it will just run for some time so it is about to finish so once after it got finished we just need to flash firmware file So as you can see, friends, it got finished here, and in the system as well, there is no error. So no need to worry about this ADB failed to read comment. So there is no error, no issues with that. So now again, you just need to minimize this and click on Advanced and click on ADB Side Load and swipe to ADB Side Load. And now again, you just need to enter the command ADB Space Side Load Space, and now you just need to. bring the firmware file so i have just downloaded the firmware file here here so just bring the firmware file to here and as you can see i have just uh, brought the firmware file and just click on enter so as you can see it will just flash the firmware file here and also you can see the percentage here it is at 6 percentage right now so once after this firmware flashed we just need to go to the fast boot mode using the twrp recovery and we need to format the data i'm so sorry friends i'm not skipping the video because and i'm not also fast forwarding it because there might be some issues if i do that so please bear with me and just follow the entire video So friends as you can see it is now a uh, flashed here so just minimize this click on reboot and you just need to click on fast boot so click on click on fast boot it will be redirected into the fast boot mode so let's wait for that so it will redirect it into the fast boot mode and we just need to do one thing so we just need to enter a command which is fast boot space minus w So it will show the fast boot mode here. So as you can see, this is the fast boot mode. So once it is in the fast boot mode, just enter the command fast boot minus w. So if we just enter the fast boot minus w and just click on enter, it will erase the user data. And now you just need to do fast boot. reboot once you reboot your mobile phone will be rebooted into the google pixel experience pro so friends it will be rebooted into the pixel experience room so that's all for this hope you enjoyed this thanks a lot for watching have a good day take care